So I have some key major changes for the hardcore tac ops is a faster TTK. Weapons are more deadly, increase base damage by two times and headshot damage three times. Meaning that you're going to get killed with one hit in the head. Instant kill, really. And that sounds like a good change. I love that. I love that a lot. No more spawning on the squad anymore that is also disabled and now squad leaders have a new role that can create a spawn beacon for your squad mates. So let's see how that works. Also mini map is disabled just like in any other hardcore game that you've ever played until a UAV is on. And another thing that I like about this is that only if you are in range of the UAV your mini map is disabled. So until you get in range you're not going to have any mini map. That sounds like a great thing. So make sure you're always on point and you're always either spawning a UAV and be aware of UAV jammer because UAV jammers are probably going to be a lot of help in this if you don't want your enemy team using UAV a lot. Hit markers are now disabled so you're not going to be able to see if you're hitting your enemy or your target really. And characters are slowed down by 10% in sprinting and turbo sprint. Also, the post-death cameras are disabled like in the OG World War 3, which is a, a win in my thing. And then you only get an only contextual HUD. That means minimap, health, ammo are all contextual. We even disable banner kill or hit marker. Stay focused and confirm your kills to your squad mates. So you're going to get less information on your HUD, which is a great thing. You know, this game always looks better without a HUD. And another thing too, we get revives on team wide. So meaning you're able to revive everybody, just not on your squad, but on the entire team, which sounds pretty awesome and great. I'm surprised they're adding the revive system into Tac Ops. The only revive in the game is the full bar mode. And a lot of people seem not to like it. So let's see how we like revive and hardcore Tac Ops. And then for all you vehicle lovers up there, the balancing of vehicle damage, they do more damage, but they're also going to take more damage. So be aware of those strikes, be aware of anything else. So vehicles more deadly, of course, because come on, you see a tank in actual war, you're not going to run towards it. You're going to want to run away. And for the new blueprints that we're getting, we're also getting what it seems like three vehicles, three guns and three operators. So be on the lookout for that. And hopefully you guys have fun during this hardcore tac ops mode. And uh, like always guys, enjoy the game. I'm the doctor. Oh, God. 
Аптечка. Слушайте, аптечка. Парни, 